of NFL predictions. <laughs> yes, NFL predictions. So, yeah. So, last week uh, was week two in the NFL season, and I and went. Boy, was it a doozy! Yeah, you sucked it up. I went I eight and I eight. Understood you went six and ten. You I do not understand, don't understand football. football. Yeah. We're going to see if I do so, better this week, but, you know, the Thursday game's already happened, and it's not looking too good for me. No, it is not. I am currently 17, and math is 15. difficult. 15. 17 and 15. Look at me, you go. And I'm the inverse of that. Brew. 15 and 17. Wow, so I'm beating you coming into week three. You are. We'll just by two games. we'll just well, fly through. Well, if we're ca- if we're counting the Thursday game, you're beating me by three games right now because I picked the Patriots That's and you true. picked the Jets. Yes. Um. We'll just fly through it real quick. Uh. Jets beat the Patriots. Rogers return to form? Question mark. Uh. Oh yeah, Patriots of course he chose overhyped. that game. Patriots overhyped? Question mark. A lot of questions. Yeah, I'm gonna speak. retract my going statement from four. last. I'm gonna retract my <laughs> statement from last week that the Patriots are going to the Super Bowl. They most definitely are not. Um, <laughs> but if they win this week, are they going back to the Super Bowl again? Well, next week. I don't even know who they play next week. Uh, Do they play they the play Panthers? The oh no, no, they play the Chiefs. I'm just kidding. I don't know who they uh, play. Do they even play the Chiefs this season? I don't even. No, know. probably not. No, I almost guarantee you they don't. They probably don't. You're right. Okay, anyway. What's the first Sunday game? Which is tomorrow, which hey. is probably going to be today oh. by the time this comes up. Goes up. Oh, okay. the Patriots play the 49ers next the week. 49ers. They're going to get fucked. Okay. Well, let's before the realism hits in that your team might only win five games again, let's just go ahead and keep on keeping on. Uh, First Sunday game I got wrote down is Giants at Cleveland. Yeah, I'm going to Cleveland. The Giants suck. Yeah, I'm going Cleveland as well. The Giants do suck. Uh, next, Chicago and Indianapolis. Ooh. Well, I'm going Indianapolis because the Bears cannot produce more than 17 points, it seems. Yeah, I'm also going Indianapolis, but I feel like this is a winnable game for the Bears. I mean, they could have beat Houston Just- if uh, you know, their offense wanted to score. Their defense was really trying to get them that game. Yeah, Houston versus Minneapolis. I'm going Houston. I don't know how the Vikings I am, are going now. I am also going Houston. Uh, I think the Vikings got some injuries. Oh, good grief. The dogs are fighting. Uh, Philly going to New Orleans. You know what? I'm not sold on New Orleans. I'm not sold that they're this fucking super team somehow. I don't understand how they blew out Dallas 44 to 19 or whatever the hell the score was. 40 plus points two weeks in a row. Don't think they're dropping 40 on Philly. I don't know if Philly can drop more than 20 in a game. Well, I, I, well, I guess they can because of that Green Bay game, but that was in Brazil and the turf was fucked. I'm going Philly though. I don't. I don't believe the Saints are all that. I don't. I, I think yeah, so they're, they're gonna put an end to the pulling our leg season? here. Yeah. Yes. No. No. I uh, think they're gonna expose the Saints here. Yeah, I agree. I'm also going Philly. Uh, Chargers versus Pittsburgh. So, is how serious was Herbert's injury last week? From what I have read, is no matter if Herbert plays or does not play, Harbaugh said they will be more focused on the run game than the pass game. Well, the Steelers, dude, so. these are sit teams that play in such similar ways. They depend on they depend on the run. They depend on their defense. See, I don't know. I feel like if Herbert does play, he might be limited. So, I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I got Pittsburgh going to three and zero, dude. Yeah. I got Pittsburgh as well. Uh, Justin Fields was not the problem in Chicago, is all I can tell you. Um, Denver versus Tampa Bay. Tampa. I also picked Tampa Bay. Will you pick a different team, please? Green Bay versus Tennessee. Green Bay. God damn you. Uh, These are the easy Pookie ones. Bears, I don't know if Pookie Bear is playing. He might be. If not, it's up to it's Malik Willis' revenge game. Well, yeah, no, I think the Packers are being the Titans either way. The Titans suck. Yeah. <laughs> Their defense is good, though. Uh, Carolina yeah, well, versus Las Vegas. I, my question is, why did Aaron Rodgers not play against the Titans like he did against the Patriots? It makes me sad. Uh, the Raiders are going to whip the Panthers' ass. Raiders are about to look like a super team. <laughs> Miami versus Seattle. <laughs> Seattle. You motherfucker. 
By the we way, got I think every Las game Vegas and Seattle. Yeah. Yeah, every uh, game the same, besides the Thursday one that's already happened. Hey, if if uh, we pick every game the same, then that means I win this week automatically. Yeah, I feel like we there might be one upcoming that we end up picking different, but I don't know if we're even going to Denver pick versus one. Arizona. You mean or the Detroit? Rain, you mean Los Detroit. Angeles? Sorry. Oh, the, yeah, yeah, Detroit. yeah, Detroit versus I'm picking Arizona. Detroit. Yeah. I'm picking Detroit. I am. I also picked Detroit. <laughs> Baltimore versus Dallas. Okay, this is the game I think we may pick different, but I am. I'm going Baltimore. I think they need this win. I also picked Baltimore. You son of a bitch. <laughs> San Francisco versus the Rams. I'm going San Francisco because the Rams have looked like ass for some reason. Okay, I picked the Rams. I'm going to say this is going to be their first win of the year. Hopefully. I can see it. Because Kittle, and, Kittle and McCaffrey are both out, aren't they? Because I'm no McCaffrey yeah. out for a few weeks, obviously. I thought I saw something that either Debo Samuel or Brandon IU had some sort of injury, but it may have just have been in that, that specific game. So, But I think the Rams are going to show up at home. So, uh, Kansas City versus Atlanta. I got Kansas City. Sadly. Yeah, me too. Sadly. <laughs> Jacksonville versus Buffalo. Yeah, I got Buffalo. And does Jacksonville suck? I, it looks like it. They need a new offensive coordinator ASAP. Like, they need to just fire their offensive coordinator and hire the both of us. And I think we can design. <laughs> I was watching this guy on TikTok today break down a third and like 10 play call. They had. Two routes. Okay, so they had a three receiver set, and the tight end was uh, told to stay in and block. And uh, the running back was also, I think, told to stay in and block. No, no, no. The running back ran a flat. They had two receivers running a double move down the field on third and ten, and then they had a guy just running a straight vertical route. How is that supposed to convert? How is that supposed to convert? This is like when they're down seven to nothing or something. You know, nothing crazy. Game's not on the line here. Time isn't pulling out the desperate plays already. Yeah, they're they're fucking they're pulling out Madden playbooks right now. Like, what the fuck is that? Why do you have two guys running a double move? That's what they did, dude. They loaded up Madden on the sidelines, went to coach suggestions, and they're like, "We're gonna run this." Yeah, yeah. God, and I think I I'm starting to believe now that Trevor Lawrence may be a top fifteen quarterback, but his offensive coordinators are failing him, and his head coach in Urban Meyer did not help him at all either. But yeah, well, I think I, I think I last think... week uh, Josh Allen proved your statement of uh, he's he's doing that MVP thing where where he's gonna look like front runner for MVP until I don't know he has a few bad games like he does every season for some reason. But I, yeah, I he throws like he's... five picks or something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I sent you those MVP odds the other day. Why? Yeah, they made, so they made so much sense. They made so much sense. Patrick Mahomes at number one, three touchdowns, three interceptions. Why wouldn't he be number one? You know. Get the fuck out of here. I hate I hate that so much. I and think Josh Allen should people, be number one right now. Yeah, Josh Allen is playing. He is the only reason his team is in contention right now for anything. No, and I mean, um, the defense did pretty good against Miami, too. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I take that back. You're right. You're right. <laughs> but uh, Washington, Cincinnati. Cincinnati's getting their first win here. God damn it. You know what? I'm I'm switching. I'm going to pick Washington. Okay. To be different. I'll pick Washington. So we got, well, we had a total of three games different this week, two that are yep. happening tomorrow and Monday. Yep. Uh, in terms of tiebreakers last week, guess who? You beat almost me again. I got it. I almost got it. Nailed you were off by a point. One. I was off by one point. I'm really proud of myself on that one. Uh, and I was off by like, what? I was off by five. Yeah. So in terms of uh, tiebreaker for the Monday game this week, which Monday? What do you game think? Going? Total. Uh, we'll do Washington Cincinnati because it seems like yeah, the, that's the one we got different, more interesting of the yeah. Huh. Uh, what's the total combined points you got for this game? I'm gonna go forty-one. Dude, we are always in the same ballpark. I got thirty-eight. Hey. Yeah, I think that's the closest. We both been. think. Yeah, we both like think this is gonna be kind of a relatively lower. Lowerish scoring game, kind of. Yeah, I think I think if there's a lot of points, it's going to be on Cincinnati side. But who knows with how their offense has been playing? Yeah, I just I don't know. I don't I don't trust the Commanders, but I think Jaden Daniels. 
Hey, man, they won is... with seven field goals last week, okay? That is true. I Who feel they like beat? they were just trying to break a record for most field goals made in the game or something. Probably. They probably were. It was Dan Quinn over there on the sideline. He's like, I lost 38 or 28 to 3 in the Super Bowl. It was a 31 20, whatever. I don't know. We take that three when we can, damn it. Yeah, yeah, no shit. Yeah, but yeah, that's. Yeah, I just kept seeing the score updates for that game, and it was just like Washington plus three, Washington plus three. I'm like, bro, are they? They're just kicking bill goals over there, okay? Yeah, they're. This this week will be. I think this is one of the weakest weeks we've had so far in terms of games. I don't see a lot of. uh, I think Philly versus New Orleans will be interesting. I think if Baltimore versus Dallas should be. I, I feel like if any if nothing else, that game should show us what both of those teams actually are. Yeah, but Dallas gets blown out again. They suck. Agreed. Yeah, I don't know how. I, I'm just. I my, the main reason I picked Baltimore for that game is like just. I feel like they're going to be frustrated at that after that Raiders loss. There's no reason they should have let the Raiders come back and win that game. Yeah, Baltimore has some of the worst like comebacks like against them in recent memory. There's a there's a uh image that I saw the other day and it was like uh it's like imagine the Ravens losing all of these games and it was all these games where they're up by like double digits or something like that and every single one of them ended up being a comeback loss. Wow. Like by the other team, that. yeah. Yeah, if I could find it again, I'll send it to you. But it's it's actually insane how many they actually have, like, comeback losses. Yeah, I think if the Cowboys yeah. do win, I think it's going to be pretty much entirely their defensive line getting to Lamar and his offensive line not being able to protect him at all. Agreed. But, I mean, if Baltimore but, gets think, that run game going, I think they got it. Yep. Yeah. All right. But other than that, I think that's it for this week. Yeah, that's been it. That's been that so random. And we'll be back with uh some Joker talk before Joker 2 and NFL Week 4 predictions. Hopefully before yeah, Thursday. Yeah, if, buddy. If, if not, definitely before next Sunday. Yeah, buddy. All right. We'll see you next time.